Here's the latest information on Hurricane Irma as of 11 a.m. today. This is Saturday from our Global American Weather Center here in Vero Beach. This forecast is for the Palm Beaches through Vero Beach. You asked for some video, there it is. This is the video right outside the condo, Victoria condo here in Vero Beach. Currently, Irma is running about nine miles an hour, and uh, it's about a Category 3 hurricane. The good news is uh, for West Palm Beach and the Vero Beach area is that the track is going even further west than it had done before. And as they keep saying, uh, we're not out of the woods yet. So let's just be very careful and be very vigilant. But it does look like we have dodged yet another big major hurricane uh, bullet. Doesn't mean that we're out of the woods, but it does mean that we have to be vigilant. And we are going to receive some winds and some fairly high winds up to as much as 80, 85 miles an hour. But that won't be until tomorrow night. Now I'm referring to Palm Beach through Vero Beach. That won't be until tomorrow night, Sunday night, and on into Monday morning. We will begin to feel the wrath of Hurricane Irma sometime on Sunday, probably uh, Sunday around noontime. We will, the winds will begin to pick up for our area. Uh, obviously, the Palm Beach area, will, the winds will pick up quicker and earlier than they will up here in the Vero Beach area. Nonetheless, it is still a very dangerous storm, and we will keep you informed. It has moved somewhat to the west again, which means that it's going to start hugging the coast of the west coast of Florida, and uh, we're not going to be seeing that uh, eye coming over our area as we were talking about yesterday. So just keep uh, tuned to this station, and we'll keep you informed. The next official report will be at 5 o'clock today, Saturday. 5 o'clock today, Saturday. Thanks for watching, too our video report on Hurricane Irma from Global American Enterprises, Vero Beach.